Thank you, Tikva. So, wow. Uh, so as Tikva said, I'm a director of digital strategy at Rodale, which publishes men's health and women's health. Essentially, we are the ab experts of the world. Now, I didn't always know as much about abs as I do now. Previously, I was back in the fall of 2008, I was overweight, broke, and my girlfriend had just dumped me. Why? Because I had an internet startup, and it wasn't called Facebook. But I had this amazing plan. I had just seen the movie 300, and I figured if I could get the body of a Spartan, my entire life would be turned around. Unfortunately, I was a failure at working out by myself. And so I was ready to give up until I saw a casting call for a video infomercial. They were looking for a before and after model. And I said, you know what? Maybe it's worth checking out. The deal was that in exchange for being a, doing a testimony for them, they would train me for three months, six days a week, and they would provide me with all my food. One caveat was I had to give up alcohol, right? So I decided to go to the casting, and at the casting, they line everybody up. We take our shirts off, and we stick our bellies out, and they take Polaroids of us. <laughs> and then we have to go to an interviewer where we have to prove that we have the right stuff to uh, make it through an intense 90-day training program. Later that night, I got a call from the program leader. He said, congratulations, you've been selected as one of 60 people to participate in a 90-day total body makeover with Brett Hobel, the guy from The Biggest Loser. And I was like, wow, that's incredible. So the next day, I got on the train, went to my before photo shoot, and I had one of the most uh, brilliant and shallow insights of my life. I have to be nice to everybody there, because sure, they're fat now, but at the end, they're going to be hot, and I'm single. <laughs> So when I got to the shoot, I look around, and I realize there's a token old person, young person, token black person, Hispanic, which meant that I was the token white guy. <laughs> and so I go up for my photos. They weigh me in. I'm 163 pounds and 20% body fat. And I get up to the photographer, and I'm smiling, and he says, stop smiling. Stick out your belly and relax all of your muscles. So during the first 10 days, there's a huge, huge, intense uh, pressure to lose a lot of weight because it costs half a million dollars to run one of these programs. And so they cut the healthy amount of calories by half. And you're working out an hour a day, which has really weird effects on the body. First of all, you begin to go through a process called ketosis. And my sweat and clothing began smelling like vinegar. It was disgusting. Then what happens is that your, uh, you have other side effects. People start getting injured. At one point, I dislocated my leg, requiring two people to hold me in place and put it back into place. And then somebody was lucky enough to have somebody take a photo of me screaming. <laughs> you are always hungry because your metabolism accelerates. And by 9 PM, I was so tired, I'd pass out. Also, my body temperature rose. And it was high all the time, which was kind of cool because it meant that I was always the hottest guy in the room. <laughs> I would have to eat more. I was eating the equivalent of seven pounds of chicken a day, two protein bars, two protein shakes, and a slew of supplements to build muscle, about 4,000 calories a day, which meant with that amount of protein, I was producing a lot of gas. And with 30 people in a room producing lots of gas, stretching and working out, it was disgusting. Luckily, though, it all ended on the day of the after shoot. And on this day, you come in, you work out to look huge, they cover you with oil, and then they uh, adjust the lights onto you so that your uh, abs look great, and they teach you this trick. They tell you to give the finger and laugh. You take your thumb, put it on your side, pull your skin back, take your forefinger, pull your skin down to show your abs, and then you laugh. <laughs> and it flexes. Try it. So are you curious how it turned out? Yes? Well, let's check it out. You could do crunches all day, and your abs could still look like this. Don't you want them to look like this? I'm Brett Hobel, and I want to welcome you to Rev Abs. So last weigh-in, 153 pounds, 7% body fat. I got the body, got the love of my life, and got a great job at Rodale 
And I'm Jonathan Levy, and this is The Secret Life of a Before and After Fitness Model.